Survivors dug by hand through villages in eastern Afghanistan which were reduced to rubble by a powerful earthquake that killed at least 1,000 people. In Paktika province's hard-hit Gayan district, villagers stood atop the mud bricks that was once a home. Others carefully walked through dirt alleyways, gripping onto damaged walls with exposed timber beams to make their way. The quake was Afghanistan's deadliest in two decades, and officials said that a toll could still rise. An estimated 1,500 others were reported injured, the state-run news agency said. The disaster inflicted by the 6.1 magnitude quake heaps more misery on a country where millions face increasing hunger and poverty, and the health system has been crumbling since the Taliban retook power nearly 10 months ago amid the US and NATO withdrawal. The takeover led to a cutoff of vital international financing, and most of the world has shunned the Taliban government. How and whether the Taliban allow the world to offer aid remains in question as rescuers without heavy equipment dug through rubble with their bare hands. The Taliban and the international community have struggled to aid the disaster's victims.